Hey everyone, welcome back to the place we were testing every single KN95 on Amazon. That's right, at first I shied away from it. You know, I don't know why, I just didn't love the KN95s, but I found out that you people do, and I, I'm a whore for attention. So we are doing this today. <laughs> we are looking at the OPEC, oh, OPEC, like the the oil people, they made a mask. OPEC did, did KN90, right, I'm gonna put it in the clamper and uh, let's get this thing started. Then I can make terrible jokes. If Eric isn't laughing, it's not a good joke. That's the, cause it doesn't take much. The bar is very low. Chuckle up a storm, that one. <laughs> All right, let's put this in here. So I can tell right away, this is not a KN95. How Lloyd, how can you tell that so quickly? Bam. This is a PFE machine, particulate filtration efficiency machine. If you want to find out what the heck this thing is doing, I'm going to put a link up there for you. And uh, what it's doing, spoiler alert, is shooting you know, thousands of tiny particles through and we're counting them to see what gets through the mask. We're, we're doing uh, the NIOSH test here, the N95 test. It turns out that it's the same as the KN95 test. So I can tell you if this mask would likely pass standards. Um, now, I mentioned something. I said, this is not a KN95 mask. If this is your first time seeing my videos. Buckle up, this is gonna be so much fun. You're gonna tell all your friends about this. I can even look at this listing and tell you it's not a KN95. And that's because it just says KN95 on it. If something says KN95, just those letters, that's not, those aren't magical. You can't just like, staple KN95 to a piece of paper that you found on the floor and hope it protects you. That's not how this works. KN95 is a Chinese standard. In fact, it is the GB2626 standard. And I'm trying to see if they say which year they're using, but they don't even say that. In order for it to be a part of that standard, you need to have three things on the mask. You need to have KN95, you need to say GB2626 on it. I know, thrilling. And the third thing is the manufacturer name. Now, a lot of times on Amazon, the manufacturer name is very, very long. This one is the Dogagen Sengtor Plastics Product Co. Yet when you go onto the listing, it's the OPEC, I don't know. It's like both brand names are terrible. <laughs> but uh, this manufacturer is probably making masks for more than one mask brand. And they can't do that if they had to put their actual name on all these masks. So. There's really no penalty in China for not following the standard in America, if they're selling it in America, so they do it. But what I have found is oftentimes, uh, if it just says KN95, it doesn't end up passing the other tests, which you should care about because you want something to actually protect you. Now, the, the KN95 is telling you that it, oh, I found it, don't worry people. I know you're worried. 2626, 2019, that's the new one. Oh, thank God, we found it. They are making a claim that it will protect you, uh, will protect, will block 95% of particles. That's what the 95 stands for. But does it? Does it? How could you know? How could you know unless you had this like big fancy lab, unless you were stupid like me and invested in all this stuff? Well, you could watch my videos. Much cheaper. Uh, 99.654. That's pretty good. What was the breathability? 135? 135 pascals on the breathability. Anything below 150 is going to be pretty good. I've seen KN95s below 100 pascals, which is like super breathable, but it's gonna be a breathable mask, you know, not bad. So good on the breathability. I'm gonna do the quick mask uh, smell. It smells like a paper box, which I've had worse, which I've had worse. Um, and it looks like decent construction. You know, what's funny is that like, I didn't really love the packaging, no soft touch. I didn't love the font they use for KN95, I got a lot of judgments up in here. Trust me, you don't want to you don't want to get in here. I didn't think it was going to do this well, but it did. Opecatic whatever. You guys made a decent mask. All right, thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you've enjoyed this. If you have, or not, actually I don't care if you enjoyed it, to be honest. Just give me a like and a subscribe. That's all I'm here for. Here for the likes. Just kidding. I'll catch you on the next test.